Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hey, what's up? My name is Caitlin. Today we're going to be doing one of my favorite videos to film, which is my Ipsy unboxing. You guys know if you've seen any of my videos that <laughs> unboxing videos are my favorite. But yeah, we're just going to go ahead and dive right into this. Um, Ipsy is, this is the Ipsy Glam Bag Plus, by the way. Like, I should probably have said that. But Ipsy Glam Bag Plus is a $25 a month subscription service. That was weird. <laughs> My door just opened. Okay, we're gonna ignore that. <laughs> um, but it's a $25 a month subscription service. My hair is curling that comes to your house every month. You get five, four to five full size or deluxe size products. And yeah, let's just go ahead and dive right in. I already have pre-opened this because I take forever to open labels. And when you open it, it says discover yourself. We've got some orange foam and here are the products. So let's go ahead and dive right in. I've said that like five times now. I have nowhere to put anything, so. Um, you do get a little card. It says shine on right here. I wanna see, it does have products. Okay, it does have prices in there, so that's awesome. First thing I see is this guy. This is the Evolu Super Oil. Okay, directions apply two to three drops in AM or PM is needed. No animal testing, that's awesome. Is this for hair or face? I don't even know. How do I open this? <laughs> okay, so there's a lid on there and I just popped it off by squeezing this. So there's that. It smells very floral. Ooh, I don't know what this is. I don't like the way it feels. It feels very slimy. I hope that's for hair and not face because I don't like the way that feels. Okay, let's take a peek in here. Um, super oil, instant moisture without heaviness. This plant-based squalane oil goes on like a serum. It soaks in instantly and doesn't leave behind any greasy residue. It's for skin. I don't know about that, I have hiccups right now. Hold please. Okay, <laughs> sorry, hiccups. Um, I don't know, we'll try it. I'm not super excited about that, but we will try it. Okay, next thing is open. This is by Tarte. This is the Stay Spray. I did choose this, so I knew I was getting this, but I'm always down for a new setting spray. And this is the full size, which is super exciting. Oh, I forgot to tell you what the price of that oil was. I'm all over the place. That oil's value is $68. <laughs> no. Okay, um, hmm. I'm really upset I wasted so much of it now because that's expensive and it feels weird. Okay, this is $25. So not great, but not super bad. Let's test the mist out. Okay. Ooh, it smells like aloe. Is there aloe in here? Shake well, I did not do that, but that's okay. Can you tell me? This makeup setting mist from Tarte is a bestseller for good reason. The microfine spray with cooling aloe and cucumber extracts keeps your keeps your look from melting, cracking, fading, or settling into fine lines for up to 16 hours. Okay, I'm down for that. You definitely smell the aloe in here. Or maybe it's the cucumber. I don't know. <laughs> they smell the same to me, but I'm down for that. Next thing in here, I have two of. Am I supposed to have two of these? Yes, okay. This is a lip balm set in peppermint and vanilla. I'm down for some lip balm. The set is, I can't see without my glasses. The set is $7.98. Five ingredients, that's it. The balm leaves lips soft and supple with 100% certified beeswax and organic coconut, olive and essential oils. A hint of stevia helps indulge your sweet tooth and protect your lips from the winter chap. It doesn't say if it's cruelty free or not, but I think it probably is. Do you say anywhere? USD egg organic first dip safety seal. <laughs> it doesn't say it's cruelty free, but I'm going to assume it is. We will definitely look that up though, of course. This is by Noya. Did I even say that? Noya? Noya? I don't know. N O Y A H. It's got that little little uh, mark over the N, the N, the O. Ah, I can't talk the O though, so I don't know what that means. Not really smelling a lot of vanilla. Which one are you? Peppermint? Is that what you're called? 
yeah, peppermint. Let's see if this one smells more like peppermint. I really hope these are cruelty free because I love lip balm. It's what I usually wear. I don't wear a lot of lipsticks anymore. So, oh yeah, that one's peppermint. <laughs> Definitely smell the peppermint in that one. Okay. Next, this guy. This is by Morphe. Not too happy with Morphe right now, but <laughs> moving on. Um, this is a lipstick. It's a Mega Matte Super Matte in the shade Morphe. Is that the shade name? It just says Morphe. Um, Mega, Morphe Mega Matte Lipstick in Morphe. This lipstick from Morphe is the ultimate beauty power move. The cherry red color and trendy matte finish are flirty, fierce, and festive, and most importantly, fun. Okay, cool. This retails for $9. That's not bad. I'm not like super into red lipsticks. I love red lips, don't get me wrong. But if I want a red lip, I usually go for a liquid lip. Oh, I love the packaging on these though. I love the like, um, it's like a diamond, but it's like slanted. I'm down for that. Ooh, pretty. Doesn't smell like anything. Oh yeah, that's definitely matte. Okay, I will try it for sure. Um, it's a really pretty color and I really like the packaging. So if anything, I'll display it, I guess. <laughs> Next um, is this guy. We're gonna skip the last product real quick so I can show you the bag. It's very similar to the other Ipsy bag, which I have right here in front of me, but that one had green, this one has blue. So that's cool. Um, I'm kind of over getting these bags just because I have so many of them at this point and I don't know what to do with them. But the last product in here is this guy. This is by, I think it's Itsy. Yeah, Itsy Cosmetics. This retails for $60. I know Coffee Break with Danny and what was her name? Glamour Beauty, something like that. She used to have a YouTube channel, she doesn't anymore, but um, they both did a collaboration with Itsy. I don't own either of them, but I really would like to, but I'm excited to try Itsy. This is a magnetic palette, and then you open it up, I'm assuming you get shades in here. Yeah. Oh, okay. That's a little less exciting, but still exciting. Okay, it's got like a tear away paper that's not tearing away, but there's a mirror in here. We've got this little guy here. Oh, yes, okay. So it comes with this little foam insert that you can put in the palette so that you can just have the four shades in there and have them protected, but you can remove that and then there's more magnetic space, so that's cool. Um, and when I first saw it, I thought it was just four and I was not excited about that, but let's go ahead and swatch these shades real quick. I don't think they have names. If they do, I don't know what they are because they are not on here, but there's the four shades. I really like that gray shade. The like grayy, grayish, the gray beige shades are my favorite for transitions. Oh yeah. Okay. I like those. They're all matte. So it's not like super exciting, but I'm definitely gonna try them out. And I've never tried Itsy Cosmetics, so I'm excited to try a new brand. Okay, that's everything. <laughs> that went by quick. Um, yeah, it's only been eight minutes. Let's just awkwardly set here so I can take up more time. No. Okay, quick little recap. I got the Tarte Spray, which I'm super excited for. Definitely want this. Obviously I picked it for a reason. So I'm excited about that. The little face oil that's ridiculously expensive and plain and boring looking. I'm not super stoked about, like I will try it, but I did not like the way it felt on my hand. It just felt very, very like, uh, like sticky. It felt like lip gloss on my hand. So I don't know, we'll, we'll try it. And then I have the two chapsticks, which I'm super excited for if they are cruelty free. I of course will look it up and let you know down below like I always do. Everything else is cruelty free though, except for maybe these, I don't know. <laughs> but. Um, yeah, lip balms are always great. I have so many of them and I'm always excited to get more. The Morphe lip or lipstick, I, I am on the fence about. Like, I don't really love red lipsticks, like I said, but I do really like the packaging and I think it's a really pretty color, so I will try it, but I don't have high hopes. And the last thing is the palette. I really like the palette itself. I think it's really pretty and the colors are okay. I really, really like this grayish color. The other three, I'm kind of like whatever about, but I will try them and I'm definitely excited to have another little mini palette that I can take with me so I could pop things out and put in here for travel. So that's everything. <laughs> Let me know down below what you guys got in your bag. 
or if you've got any of the products I've got, I got, or if you've tried any of the products I got and you liked them or didn't like them, let me know why. <laughs> and yeah, don't forget to like this video before you go. Subscribe to my channel so you don't miss out on any more of my future videos. I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye guys.